flight boss, bitch. You're now listening to the mind of an Antares Moon. I'm the Archangel Uriel, and I'm here to carry out God duties and motherfucking responsibilities. And right now, we're going to talk about the negative side to your motherfucking zodiac sign. And right now, we're going to get into motherfucking Libra. Now, off the motherfucking back. I'm gonna tell you right there. I'm gonna tell you right here. When you when, when Libras jump into their negative bag, the first thing you're gonna be able to see is motherfucking indecisiveness. Now, indecisiveness is gonna play out in so many realms of realities in Libras' lives that it's gonna fuck up the people that's around them. Because the people uh, Libra don't know if they wanna beat your ass or not. They don't wanna know if they wanna have a conversation with you or not. They don't want, they don't know if they wanna be in a relationship with you or not. They don't know if they wanna do this or do that. To the point that the people around them gonna be like, what the fuck do you want? What do you want from me? And a lot of motherfucking times, the Libras don't even fucking know. <laughs> Libras don't even motherfucking know because it's like they, 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 and they can get into a motherfucking selfish bag. They, they do every fucking, do a lot of shit and then when they need time to their motherfucking self, they become very fucking selfish. Then they gave out all this energy, making other people feel like they, they need them around and stuff like that. Then when they can't get away from these people for one second, when it's time for them to brood, they can have a motherfucking sharp tongue. And this motherfucking sharp tongue can fucking pierce your fucking soul. Because it's almost like, it's almost like you don't even know if they, if they complimenting you. It's almost, it's almost like Gemini, but Gemini is, is not being sarcastic. They're a little bit more direct because it's cardinal. So it's almost like they know how to cuss your ass out real good. You may even like getting cussed out by the Libra. Like they, they got a sad, they got a motherfucking way with words, especially a Libra moon. Uh, these motherfuckers know how to cut, like, you, uh, you may, they may say something like, uh, Man, yo, look at your fucking, yo, yo, weak ass $600 shirt. You know what I'm saying? You'd be, you be like, damn, this motherfucker give me a compliment or did they diss me? You know what I'm saying? You'd be like, what the fuck? Man, they got a motherfucker, sharp ass motherfucking tongue. For real. And another motherfucking thing about uh, uh, Libras is, uh, negative trait is, they think about motherfucking, now you might think this positive, but it could be, it, nah, not in the other people's life. You could think about sex all the motherfucking time. I mean, all the motherfucking time. I mean, you, you motherfuckers thought it was Scorpio. No, no, Scorpio, that's another video. That's just that's dealing with desires or something like that. Somebody desires may not even have anything to do with uh, sex. So that's that's different. Scorpio is different. We go, when we talk about Libra, it's sex. This is the actual joining of two energies. Aries is the self. Libra is the, is the self and another joining together. So what happens here is they think about sex all the motherfucking time. I mean, it's on their fucking mind. They like to do it, and and and, and it's like mental sex. They even like mental sex. So it's like lower lower vibrational Libras. You know what I'm saying? It may even come out as uh, them to actually talk about sex 24/7 or always thinking about sex, always being on their mind. But high, more higher elevated Libras, a lot of times. A lot of times, just them even having a good conversation with someone is like mental sex. <laughs> they like have mental sex and shit like that. So, uh, yeah, it's crazy. But, uh, like, you know, the negative sides of Libras, uh, y'all motherfuckers can have sharp tongues. Y'all could be manipulative. Y'all could be, uh, y'all could be, um, two-facing also. But not like, like Gemini where you don't feel like you're doing nothing wrong. You guys be two-facing for the sake of, uh, Trying to create uh, situations, trying to turn people against each other, trying to stir stir up the pot, trying to make uh, people, and, and you always want to, uh, here's another negative thing too, a lot of times, you always want to do uh, things with other people. And it's gonna, it's gonna, it's, it play out negative because a lot of times you're gonna put yourself in situations where you're gonna surround yourself about, around a lot of people who don't want to do that with you. So you start to feel like, do people care about you or not or things like that? Or why nobody want to do stuff to me? Then a negative side come out. Because once Libra jump into that selfish bag, the way Libras look at selfishness is not the way how selfishness is supposed to be perceived. So it it, 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 it becomes negative into other people's lives, lives when a Libra becomes selfish. Because a Libra try to turn people on other people. They try to manipulate this person away from this person for the sake of being selfish or 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 this that and the third um another negative trait to libras a lot of times it can be become real materialistic they can almost become like earth signs because saturn is exalted here so they become real real materialistic real materialistic to the point that everything that they do everybody that they conversate with everybody that they build bonds with everything that they get into has something to do with trying to gain some stability um in the material world so that's another negative trait. Woo, woo, stomach kicking ass. Now, uh, motherfucker, also, also with Libras, a lot of times, right, the negative side, they jump into bad relationships. 
on purpose just to get out of another relationship or just to do or just to get out of something or do something else or do that they get into relationships to do things see because a lot of times this is opposite from the first house so a lot of times the stuff that you're supposed to originally do for yourself Libras will use other people to do that. You see, you see what I'm saying? They use conversation or use their way or use their own actions to to do things for what well, to allow other people in their life to kind of correlate what they want to do. You see what I'm saying? Just for they won't have the all all the blame or it'd be fair a little bit. And they could try to be too fair, too balanced, too compromising. So if it's a Libra in, a, in an area of life that's negative, you're gonna be too compromising to negative type shit. You know what I'm saying? If, if, er, if everybody in the group robbing, you, you wanna make sure you helping everybody. <laughs> if everybody, uh, like it's like that type of shit. You know what I'm saying? You gotta make sure that your Libraness, you're you're not trying to be fair and balanced in the wrong areas of life. You know what I'm saying? Because that that's it become negative, negative to the point that you feel like you gotta do everything. You feel like you gotta relate and help everybody. You know what I'm saying? So if y'all going around on a killing spree, you don't want to feel like it should be fair. You don't want to feel like okay, if I kill this many people, you should kill this many people too, or then we can do this together. And then, then I just y'all need, need to get the fuck out of that realm of reality, period, and change y'all fucking uh, y'all motherfucker uh, 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 occupation. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> now, also another thing, another negative side to Libra: you motherfuckers can think too much, think way too much, and when you think too much, it's a it, it becomes. Communication and conversation. So because you can talk too much. Talk too motherfucking much. And then when you start when you start realizing other people are not listening, that's when you start to create chaos with air. Create tornadoes and shit. Just create tornadoes and actions and scenarios and words and shit like that. Become very negative. Uh, word things very negatively. Because you know the right words of what it take to stir the pot up, to, to get things mixed, to get things going, and things of that nature. So uh, get out of your head, cause because you think you're in your feelings, but you you really in your head. Huh? So that's that's negative, that's negative. Because being in your feelings, you can emotionalize with someone. But when a Libra think they're in their feelings, they're in their head. So they're trying to intele intellectualize and put shit in a box and see how it's fair and how it can be balanced. So when it come out. Uh, you express yourself and another person is not even catching no emotional feeling. They just catch them like, is this person trying to relate or compromise something for their favor? They're trying to manipulate and, 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 and you probably is. You probably is going over that person's house every day because you're trying to fuck their girl. Fucking Libra. And you fucking Libra females. Look, that's not your fucking friend. We know you fucking him. All right, look, I take your, if I take your motherfucking phone and looking at all these numbers, no, no, that's not your friend at work. No, that that's not the dude who, who you go get trams or vites from or, or Percocets from. Oh, no, that's not, no, no, that's not your, uh, no, that's not the your fucking best friend's boyfriend. No, we know that's somebody you fucking. <laughs> Shit. Fuck you gonna tell me. You just got all these relationships, all these different type of relationships, business relationships, friend relationships. You got all these different relationships. All these fucking fucking relationships. Fucking Libra. <laughs> you sneaky ass motherfucker. Y'all motherfuckers are sneaky. You sneaky ass. Gemini's are sneaky too. You fucking Gemini's are sneaky. You fucking Libra's are sneaky. You go around try to word shit right to try to make people think you ain't. Fucking negative beast. <laughs> you, you negative loving motherfuckers. Venus, God the hell. Air. Leave a negative side.